Hey Sabrin here, uh, and I decided to make a very short video about Salome, CFD and Code Saturn. Uh, I had a few feedback on the blog of some people telling me that, you know, Salome CFD isn't working correctly on their install, and they're just wondering how they can use Code Saturn um, if this doesn't work, basically. So, uh, I experienced myself a few problems with the install of Salome CFD, so uh, I think what you can do is use um, either the more general Salome, like uh, Geom to create the geometry and SMesh to create the mesh, and then you can use uh, Code Saturn without the GUI as a, you know as a separate uh, program, as a separate module. Uh, and it, the good news is that if you have Salome CFD installed, you already have Code Saturn, and you can use it without using Salome actually. So let me show you here how to do that. So first you have to find out where is your Salome CFD installed or your Code Saturn install. Um, and then go into uh, go into the folder where it is actually installed. So not this one, this one, yes. So you'll see you have a folder called modules. And if you click on that, you have all the modules which are inside Salome, which are inside uh, installed inside this folder, actually. So the, the, the module for Code Saturn is called CFD Study. So you click on that, and you have a bin folder, in which generally the, uh, the exe, well, the executable um, install is, uh, is here uh, inside it. So as you, you see this file, Code Saturn, so this is the exe executable file for Code Saturn. So how to launch that? Well, you have to go into the terminal. So right click, open terminal. So I, I am on, on Ubuntu 16.04 uh, here. Uh, but the, the good news is that Code Saturn without Salome can be used on Windows, I think. There is an install available and also on, on Mac OS. So you probably have to compile it yourself. Uh, and I may do that in another video, but um, well, the point is that, okay, I'm, I'm on Ubuntu, uh, and now I just, you know, I entered into this folder, so you can just CD into this folder as well, it works uh, as well, right? And once you are in this folder, well, the problem is how do you launch this? Um, well, the, the best way is to look at the help, so you just do like that, code Saturn, and then help, enter, and you'll get a few comments which are, are available. So you see that you can create a study directly from the from this using I think uh, create. And you, you have you have to go in the documentation and it's actually written how to create a study, how to do all the things directly in that. Uh, but the easy way is to use the GUI. So the GUI is also available in this way. So you just have to type code Saturn GUI and then it opens up like that. And, and once it, this is actually exactly the same, uh, same thing, which is into the Salome CFD, except that it's uh, more stable. So that's why you can generate the mesh and everything with Salome. Um, and, and then you just save it into a folder that you open into this, uh, this separate GUI. So when you have it, just click on new project, you know, new file, and you'll get the exact same, um, you know, same uh, GUI that I am explaining in the, my other videos about Code Saturn. So you can have a look at those videos to 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 see how to set up uh, an actual CFD study. Let me just show you and open one of the CFD study I did in the past. So, um, for example, the the cavity. I think it was my first video. Uh, and you have to open the case data folder setup.xml. This uh, and once you open this, you have all the boundary condition, all the stuff which are set up for your model. And you see that the the model and the mesh is actually set up in this mesh selection. So if you generate the med file with your your Salome, um, it it doesn't have to be Salome CFD, actually, it can be the Salome uh, 9.3 that you installed previously, or even Salome Mecha, uh, and then you generate the med file, and then you can, you can uh, directly import it here into 
this separate uh, code setter. So, for example, if you have Salome Maker and you don't want to install Salome CFD separately, that's also a way to, you know, to get code setter. You can you can compile it separately and then use it like this to to do CFD studies in in addition to mechanical. And basically, you can you know you can solve you can uh, post process using uh, Paraview or Paravis, um, and, and that's it. And um, let me show you where, uh, if you're interested also, I would recommend you to have a look at the documentation. So you have to go on the Code Saturn website for that. So the Code Saturn website is uh, codesaturn.org. And uh, you get to tab uh, documentation, and and if you you go down in here, so this is for the last version. You get, for example, the command. Re oh, that thing is fucking annoying. Anyway, command reference shit. And, and then you get uh, the basic comments, for example. So you get the GUI to launch the DUI. You get you get a very simple, uh, basically, comment sheet to use that. Um, and uh, so info, config, create to create a project and all this. And uh, I would recommend you also to have a look at the user guide, the theory guide. Well, the theory guide, maybe you don't really need that, but you know it's interesting to have a look anyway. You have the online documentation and the install guide. All that uh, will really give you the in-depth knowledge about how to use Code Saturn, and, and of course, it takes some time to to go through all of this. But uh, that that's the way to learn uh, how it works. So thank you very much for watching. I hope this uh, very simple but short video is uh, insightful uh, for some of you watching.